Welcome back, everyone. This is Let's Play Cave Story Plus. Last episode, we got two endings. In this episode, we're starting all over. But this time, instead of doing it on easy, which I'd rather do, we're gonna go harder and go with the original to get the um true ending. I'm kind of gonna try and skip through these because we already watched them once. But I'm, I'm only recording this because um some things are different later in the game. So let's go. I still don't know why he was wearing yellow. I hear how serious the game is now. Is if you know on easy you could just like dash down that thing, get hit by that spike, and be okay. If you even get touched by a spike, you die. I mean a bat don't I don't think will kill you. I remember, um... Right, Gunsmith. Someone's transmission. I'm not sure if I'm gonna fight Balrog this time. It's kinda like a waste. I'd just rather skip him. The only thing I'm going to be scared of is Balfrog. That boss is just so big and terrifying when you first fight it. See, look at that. Five health gone. If I didn't get... If that health thing would have had one less, I would have been dead. That's how serious this game gets on original. Not really. Just I'm really bad at this game. Much, I'm just gonna massacre these little innocent creatures again. And I think this is the only possessed door in the game. But I swear, it's like the worst enemy ever. Cause I remember I tried to speed run this game to try and get the um truly best ending on um Cave Story Plus instead of doing my thing that I downloaded. It's where the requirement's gone. <laughs> you have to get through all this in 14 minutes. And that door always got me and just murdered me. So here we go again, it's Sue and Toriko. Mm-hmm. Here we are. And now we don't have to waste time because I know exactly where all this stuff is. Here he is. Here's the best character in the whole game. Not really. I actually never talked to him last time. I kind of fell in the hole and didn't feel like going back to get him. Really? Really? And that fish had a derpy face too. It was just like, eh, I'm here. Here's Toriko again. Get out. The king again. I'm trying to think, um... If... At some point, you can trade King's Sword in for, um, uh, another weapon called, uh, the Nemesis. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to remember where. I'm trying to think of some of the stuff I gotta get for, um, what's it called? The True Ending. So here's Balrog. He's back. Misery 2. So I'm trying to think, where did Balrog go once he got out of like the labyrinth, or even if he did, I mean, he kind of like jumped away. So actually, I'm going to show this since we didn't see it last time. Not nothing much. Nah. He just jumps out. So um, I'm trying to remember what we do now. Oh yeah, we have to go talk to Jack. I'm actually going to save here because um, I'd rather not die. It's the 
number two. I swear, oh, he always has like his finger pointed out, like he's like pointing at you, or is he trying to like use a, have a fake gun? Cause I mean, I'll get in a gunfight with him. Like, why'd you shoot him? Self defense. He pointed a gun at me. Pretty much screw all these guys. What's up there? Oh yeah, I can't. I don't think I can reach up there. Actually, I don't think I've ever been in there. Let's get Arthur's key. So now we can get to his house. I wonder who Arthur was. I don't think it showed him at the credits. If it did, I wasn't really paying attention. Try and make these videos a little bit shorter because they've been that last video has gotten kind of, was kind of long. Although it was the ending, I didn't expect to be the last time. Just kind of I played it and I was like, eh, might as well. Cause I really don't have a certain preference on how long I want the videos to be. Just make them how long I want them to. Great start. So um. Yeah, I didn't really expect that last video to be about, I think it was an hour long. That was episode 9, maybe, I think. Hopefully these will be a lot shorter, or I'll just have them longer and there'll be less videos. To run. This. My nice life increased by 3. Okay, while I was trying to speed run the game, I found out that, um, okay, really? You can jump on these? It's kind of funny. I should actually be more careful. These guys take about four health. These guys take about, like, yeah, same amount. I should get a level up, yeah, that's better. We don't feel like killing the rhinos. They have a decent amount of XP, but I really don't care. So here we are again. There goes one cut, because my freaking home button. I was trying to say, um, but I was actually trying to speedrun this game, it was pretty funny because, uh, I got hit by one of those flies and it launched me all the way past Igor. Keep on hitting. I'm trying to think. Do I want to try it? Eh, not really. Say, do I want to try and uh try and speed run it again? Try and see if I can get the truly best thing and actually just start a new one. But I'd rather not. I can just get this health. God dang it! Really? Last time. Actually, I said that last. The last time we were here, and I stayed here for like six. So I did it six times. I finally got it. Uh, really? I hate it, because if you if you let go, you're not gonna make it. But if you hold it, you have like a delay when you jump. Got it. Can I save the game? No point in talking to Cthulhu. I may have to actually be. Wow, I said a terrible there. I may actually have to look something up because I kind of forget if, um. There's something about, like, a small man, I think it was. And I don't know who that's referring to. Because we didn't see him in the last game. I also kind of want to know how to get the best ending. 
I wish that enemy would actually hurt the uh, little things that jump. It'd make more sense. Okay, here's number six where we get the, um, what's it called? ID card. Okay. That was close. I think it'd be losing close enough. I kind of like breathed in there because I thought I was going to lose. Rather not die. Someone give me help. Someone give me help. Give me help. Yeah. Oh, really? I can't reach up there. I actually think, um. Well, at least one of you give me, like, a heart or something there. Or something. Yes. I was gonna say there's a save room right here. Oh, gosh, no. We should get in there. Can we rest here? No, we can't. But there's hearts down here. I'm trying to think, do we did we have to do something here? Or was that the other place? I'm actually gonna check that. I don't think we had to do anything here. It's the missile launcher. Actually for a speedrun tactic, you shouldn't actually get this because you'd get, um, you'd get more XP and more health instead of getting missiles. Oh god, there's more of these guys. I got hit there. Oh, this guy can't go through walls, so we just lost him. I'm not really good at dodging this. I don't know like his pattern me it's about to shoot. Level up, that's good. Can I get another level before I fight Igor? Probably not. I have two four health. Oh yeah, this is where it goes, okay. So I am okay here. We put this ID card in here, and I guess we're gonna try and fight him with, um, what's it called? Poor health. Unless this thing wants to die and give me- wow, well, it actually did. I wasn't actually expecting that, I was kinda expecting it to die and not give me health. Is there any other ones want to give me health? Or does this one give me enough to get level 3? I'm actually just go back and just try and get it. I think they should give me missiles, you know, just to forget it. I think one of them gave me health. So here we get to fight Igor. I'm not sure which professor he's talking about. I mean, there was, um, Ido. There's, um... Kazuma. Then there's the Doctor. Actually, it's not that hard. The first time it was really hard for me because I didn't really... I got really terrified of his ugly face. I actually got scared there for a second because I looked up and I was looking into my eye, I saw yellow and I thought I thought um I wasn't recording. Looks like we're gonna be here for a while. Long while just sitting here. Okay, actually maybe not. Let me go upstairs, get the missile launcher again. I'll have to go back down and get the hearts. So I'm actually going to try and go in there with the, um, what's it called, level 3 gun because it'd make it a lot better, I guess you could say. I think there's actually a heart hidden in one of the eggs. It's gonna kinda suck near the eggs, I'd rather get them all. 
I think it's only like a three, maybe, maybe five. I may come back later and check for it. I must just my stop. Actually, it may be egg two right here. Just talking about. Oh, nope, maybe it's not. Maybe it's just an easier way to get to egg one. The ID card in. I'm actually have to kind of grind a little to get some health and some XP for my gun. Come on. Okay, really? I hit my gun, just barely couldn't reach him. And now I'm pretty much stuck with this crappy one. Turn around, wait for jump back up. I don't want um yeah this guy to come back these guys right here just so I can slowly kill him and get a lot of XP hopefully. Just pretty much need like zigzag here I'm guessing back forward back forward better. Will he come back or am I have to? I might as well just to get a little extra. Just wait for this guy to come. Go back into egg one, then come back out. Just run back. And now we should have enough reach to reach that. Grab these. Grab some hearts while we're here. Kill a rhino. Come over here, come over here, shoot these guys. That guy actually hit me. That's very nice. Just out of our reach. I wish I shot it, it would give me it. Want it? Oh, no. Okay, well, we got level 3 like we wanted, so Igor should be a little bit easier now. Just kind of. It's really easy now since we have longer range, more damage. Although that heat diamond almost hit me. It probably hits me once and I'll lose my level 3, which will really suck. as far away from it as I can. I forgot about this. I think I can get him. Yeah. Didn't even hit that time. Um, while I was looking through the items I needed to get like the best end, well, the true ending, not the truly best ending. Um, there was a uh, some, there was two items that you didn't really need. They're just kind of there to look like they should have been there. That's two items if we say no. No, we didn't. Oh. Really? She says you're no help. That's really mean. Leaves. Okay, got it. Let's go in here. Side room. Now I think we have to walk all the way back. Because my memory's failing me right now. Although I just played this game like. I played this part like last week, maybe. I shouldn't be that forgetful. Just kind of dash through here. Trying to see if I can actually get max real quick. Yeah, so uh, if you get hit, it won't really do that much. That was actually really bad. I shouldn't have got hit by that. I mean, I should have. I shouldn't have. Like, I should have thought better with it. Murder everything now. Well, I could have done that easy, which is my second one, my level two. So here we are back at the start. Oh, not yet actually. So 
eggs, like, how many eggs? Like, 17, I think. Destroy the rhinos. I don't like rhinos. Actually, I do like rhinos. I'm trying to think whether after I beat this, I mean, I want to put all my, like, effort into this right now. But after I beat this, do I want to, like, put another side LP and make one of my other sides the go? the one I want, or do I want to, um, just have the two and make one of my main LP and my, one of my side. Okay. I actually want to check how long this video is, because I, I know I'm not that fast, but I want to see if I can actually make it in 14 seconds, because that's going to be kind of hard. I say 14 seconds, I meant 14 minutes. And, oh, I forgot about this part. Wait, oh yeah, he got taken from, I forgot for a second there, I was like, wait. Okay, we can't actually, thought maybe that would work. I kind of think, yeah, they're going to give Sue back for, I mean, we're, they're going to give Toriko back for Sue, but. Actually, I think they don't know about the red flowers. I guess that'd make more sense. Doctor Evil, anyway, so. There's that one guy, I still can't remember his name, although it just said it at like the end of the credits. Talk to Sue. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering, how did. If Ido got changed by Misery, does that mean Sue got changed by Misery too? <clears throat> into a Mimiga? Now we should be able to the bushlands. Here's where stuff's gonna go down because here's where we get one of our first um what's it called items. Items that we don't technically need but um are like gosh my throat are um little like things you can get. Whoa, really? Where was the last place we saved? Really? I'm just gonna cut it here and get back to the bushlands. So, yeah. Okay, so, um, welcome back. After that cut, I am back at the bushlands. I have full health this time, so hopefully I won't die so easily. Well, I think I had full health last time, and it was pretty bad. That big, um, blue one is gonna get me. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I'm gonna die. Die. Good. Got a heart. Almost at level 3. There's his key. I'm just to try and run and get it. Get it. Come on, we got Santa's key. Get out. Okay. And I'm trying to remember. Um, I may actually have to have another cut because I need to go look and see how to get Chaco's lipstick. I'll actually check something. Oh no, I can't. I was seeing if like you, if you held up, you could um. You could walk over the like little parts that you fall through. So we got the fireball. Okay, so I'm gonna pause it real quick. Well, actually, I'm gonna cut it real quick. I'll be at the same place. I'm just gonna actually go look at the item guide real quick. Okay, I found it out. So we, when we get to Chaco's house, we have to walk into her house, immediately examine the fireplace, and then go to bed. Okay, really, that was really stupid right there. Okay, all this is really stupid. 
can't wait to get my sword back. I want that really badly. Yes. Just to get my health back up to full. I can to destroy all this stuff. Stay away from the blue one, because the blue one can murder you in pretty much two hits. I'm gonna get this health thing, hope I can. Can I get from over here? Can I make the jump? I think I can, actually. I wanna get that health. Come on. I gotta think of the, the perfect place to jump from. So it's not there, it's about here maybe? I just forget it, just I really want it. You know, I'd actually probably go the other way. Probably go this way and shoot this out. Yeah. There you go, we got a life capsule, so now we have about I'm not sure how much health. I kinda miss having that little steam thing down there tell me how much I had. Um, so we're gonna watch, we're gonna wanna watch out here for the spikes. Hey, here's Shaco's house. First, we wanna just shoot all these out so they can't eat us. We walk in. Okay, if I can do it. Same in the fireplace. I'll go to sleep. So, um, we got Red Lick Scoot from Chaco's house. It has no use. Wow, unidentified ladies, man. I got all these jellyfish coming out of nowhere. I mean, like, we didn't see them, like, all the way up here. And there's, like, bam, we're here, actually. So you can't kind of cheat it and just get the jellyfish juice when you first come through. That's really funny, though, her lipstick. So, um, I guess you don't want to stay in Chaco's house. Pretty much that's what the game's telling you. Okay, gotta be really... I'm really tense about this now that we're on original because pretty much the little things that we really didn't care about in Plenty Easy can kill us really fast now. I'm probably have to, like, strategically get around the... what's it called now? I don't know what's happening, I started running. Kill it, kill it, come on. Okay, good. Yeah, I'm not sure if we're just gonna be able to do what we did last time and just shoot it out of nowhere. Good. I don't think we need the bubbles this time, so I probably won't have to go to that one house with an extra thing of jellyfish jelly. I don't think anyone actually wants it either. It's just like a little gun you can get if you want it. She just looks over that, but she didn't, she didn't think about how she was in bed when we were in bed. She slept with us. I don't know how you're supposed to do all this in 14 minutes. That's a little bit insane. That was really close. I didn't save either. And if it was like 20, actually that's still really fast. Cause like just to get through here it takes me like 15 minutes. At let, like least. Oh yeah, we gotta go over through here. Kill some frogs. Find what's his face, Kazuma. I we forgot Kazuma. He'll give us a key. We we'll use the key to open that. Yes. Give me the key. I'm actually gonna go in here and get this real quick. Execution chamber. Wait. 
Okay, now I get it. I remember how I did it the first time. You don't kill him. You jump on him. You take that out. Life capsule. Okay, so now we just kill this. Wow, this is a lot more uneventful. Oh my gosh, my stream again. Although, they're probably gonna crash it again. We don't get to save here. I better hope I can take this robot down. Because I forgot, you can't jump there because, um, what's it called? Um, the fans are off. So, like, I remember his pattern. I think he runs at you. Oh, it's Balrog, okay. Um, no, it wasn't. Actually, was I supposed to say yes? Yeah, now I got the pattern down for this. Can't do nothing now, Balrog. Okay, that was a little anticlimactic thing I was saying. Balls, I swear. I'm probably gonna get killed right now. I'm just trying to try and do this. There. I should be a shorter cycle, so I can actually shoot him some of the time. Well, can we do it? Can we do it? We actually need to do it, because I swear if I die here, I'm already We got this. We're unidentified. Whoa, I forgot she doesn't fly for like the last part. Come on. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut it because that was just terrible. Okay, I'm back. I beat Balrog. And that time was a lot better. I only got hit once and it was at the end. So let's pull up. I think his name is Malco because that's what it said on the little power thing. Yes, come on, say it. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. Mm-hmm. Okay, I want you to make bomb. So first I gotta... I actually have to fight that jellyfish again, which is gonna suck. First things first. I don't care if I just gotta level down. It's not that hard to get a level back up. I wanna save. I'm probably gonna save all the way, I'm probably gonna play all the way till I get to, um... What's it called? The sand zone, because, um... I might as well see if I actually got the, uh... If I actually got the path to the truly best ending, or not. Because if I did, I want to see it on the... New, fancier graphics, because... I'm, the only way I'm gonna... The only way we're gonna see is on the old graphics, because I'm not doing this in, like... 10 seconds, or not 10, 14 minutes. I gotta get my seconds and minutes, minutes right. Might as well jump up here and get this, since I'm already here. Okay. There's no, oh yeah, I have to... Uh-huh. Talk to him again. Wait. Rusted. I thought this is where we tell him that we're gonna use a bomb. Oh no, we tell him um, once we tell the robot. Okay, so let's go. Yep. Yep. Yeah, good person, obviously. Just trust me. Charcoal jellyfish juicing on base. Can easily get those two. The gum ones can be annoying. That means I felt. I'll have to fight Balfrog, and I'll actually try and show it on camera since... <sighs> since, um, last time my computer kind of messed up and screwed up all my data and lost that fight. Mm -hmm. 
kill the bats. Kill these things. Kill the frog. Get a level up. And I just go through murdering things. Try and get max. Let's go tell the robot. I really don't care about the missile upgrades now. I already got, um... Max power, or whatever it was. That you got all the... If you got all the missile stuff for, I think. I got I am Juggernaut, but I'd rather get the hearts because I mean you kind of need them if you actually want to win. Charcoal, jellyfish juice, scum base. Okay, hopefully let's this time not die. Okay, that was really bad right there. That was a bad jump. I kind of want to get rid of some of these bats. I don't know why. There we go. and run. Okay, now to get charcoal we need some jellyfish juice and we need to go to Santa's house. So should be the art. I don't like him being there, that's better. Oh thank no 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 oh my gosh oh my gosh I died, then came back to life, then died, then came back to life, and then died again, but I didn't come back to life the third time. So I'm dead right now. Because of how lucky that was, because every time, every time I, um, came back from invincibility, the, uh, I was hit by the little thing. So if that thing would have hit me, I would have died. That thing does so much damage, and I'm happy I got hit by the smaller one than the bigger one. I hate, they, I hate how they don't automatically fly above you, like, they'll fly above from where they were, so if, like, grass is there, they'll kind of stay in the same place. Okay, you know, I'm gonna do it anyway. To kill this thing. Get jellyfish juice. We're almost done with the grasslands. A lot faster than last time. And freaking I took ten hours doing it. Santa's house. I'm gonna heal and save because I'd rather not die. Yes, I'd rather get some charcoal. I'm really tempted to go into those spikes because that's like my favorite part of this thing. Actually, you know what? I wonder. That's kind of weird. Why would they have that in here? I mean, I guess they want to show that he sleeps. I mean, seriously, I mean, they have a health thing, so they wouldn't really need that, unless you don't know that that will actually heal you. Really? I really needed that upgrade, too. I needed it. Because I'm going to have to fight this giant jellyfish, all these other jellyfish. Everything, pretty much. I don't want to die. I can probably do this. I have so much courage in myself right now, I don't know why. I'm probably sure I can. Okay, good, I'm back at level 3, that's good. God dang it, these little flying things. I swear, like, the, they're the worst ones. And I, I don't know why. I mean, they shouldn't be. That's stupid. That shouldn't have hit me. Well, actually, that's kind of nice. I'd like to get hard, so I just want some XP, though. Here comes another one. How does that hit me? I swear, it, like, touched my foot, and I died. So here, now we actually have all the stuff. Really? That's not how it usually goes. I usually beat it before it kills me. We got jellyfish juice, we got two of the ingredients. God dang, I keep on hating how they fly. I keep on forgetting about it, and then I remember it when they're already flying, and I'm like, really? Uh, what time is it? Where's my phone? 12.31. I need to be done before one, at least. Hopefully, hopefully I will be done before one. I don't really care how long I stay up, it's just... 
stuff I gotta do. Looks like much rather. I could save there, but I'm really tempted not to just because I want to feel like amazing when I get to the next save place. I just want to feel like I actually accomplished the impossible. And if I don't, then I'm gonna be really sad. Okay. So we're nearly there. Just need to jump up. Go in here. Okay, so we're almost on the grasslands. Well, bushlands. I don't know why I call it the grasslands. It's like its brother. <laughs> that shouldn't have hit me. Talk to him. Yes. Gum base. Give me that gum key. Now we'll get to go fight Balfrog. This is the part I'm really scared about because how hard Balfrog was the first time. Having to do it again is just going to pretty much kill me. It's going to be harder. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go do it, I guess. Well, actually, we're not going to fight it right now. It's going to take me getting over there real quick. The thing had its head, like, hidden so perfectly to where I couldn't see it. Oh, good, there's a safe right here. It'd be really cool if Cthulhu would heal me. It'd be really nice of him. Oh, wait, there's stuff up here. Good. Any hearts will help. I always hate that one because you like on this one you can get to the edge and you can jump. And when you like be ready, you have to be like watching with it. There's that little hole right there that I fell through so many times. So here's now you're actually gonna see Balfrog, all the stuff that happened. Because um you didn't get to see it last time. I'm actually gonna be kinda slow for this. Okay, so I don't know why I was quiet for that, like, maybe the most reason I only stayed alive with this was, um, because, uh, how Balrog throws on frogs, and that pretty much gave me enough health to survive, but now I'm actually, I think I'm more ready for it this time. After I beat the doctor and all that stuff, I feel like I can take this on easily. These frogs go up in a weird, like, terrible places. I hate those red things, too. Yeah, here's where it comes. It comes sums down all these frogs. You have to murder them all. It's the hard part, because you, you want to watch out for them all. Oh, wait, I don't know why they shoot down. That actually really smart. See? The only reason I'm really staying alive is because she's putting down these frogs, so actually it's really helpful. Yeah, I'll keep on calling Balrog a machine when I think he's a key. I want someone to actually clarify that for me, so I can actually... I don't know how you are. I mean, I kind of ask questions of viewers, even though I know pretty much no one's going to answer. I mean, I, I can't say that. I mean, people people are probably going to answer later, if I ever do get subscribers. But right now, I have like 10 people watching my videos. Actually, like 10 people watching one of my videos. I just all left, and I only have, I have four subscribers, but I know for a fact, one of them lost their account, because it was my brother, and he forgot his password to that account, so, actually, I really don't want him seeing this. Please, I'll say, please don't let a big one pop down on me. I really want to kill these people. I have five health. Just now noticing that. Why do I get books closer to? I don't want to do that. Come on. 
I'd rather not have her drop down more frogs. Really? I hit her in the back just barely. Don't want to get too close to her all. Okay, I'm just gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut it here and actually do the boss fight on my own again. Okay, I beat him. And then that that's gonna be my this is gonna be on. Wow. I sound like I was trying to do something really stupid there. This is gonna be my honest opinion. That is my most hated boss fight of this game. It actually had such potential too. When I walked in there, saw that, and I was like, whoa, what's happening? And then I got to there, and that happened. I mean, if it would have given me an easier way to hit him, I would have been okay with it. But no, it didn't. It kinda gave me it gave you like a stupid way to hit him that you have to jump. And you have to hit all the things. Which is just stupid, pretty much. Yep, jellyfish juice and gun base. <clears throat> I'm actually probably leave that stupid part of me in the start in because that was pretty funny. I forgot what I was talking about when I left off. Actually, I'm just gonna jump up here. Yeah, I'm pretty much throwing everything away because it's just getting stupid. That boss, that boss, it's the same way it made me feel on the last one. So here's Kazuma. We already saw this. Then Booster's gonna come out. Maybe that was the professor they were talking about. I forgot about Professor Booster. They're gonna take the scooter and they're gonna crash it. Then I get to go to the sand zone and I'm probably gonna end the video. Hopefully, hopefully. This will be. I'm actually gonna check check something before I go to the sand thing. I'm still gonna I'm still gonna use that on someone. I actually used that on someone once, but it's just so annoying because no one actually says, "Do you know this person?" You have to like find like a friend of theirs. Like they'd be walking with a friend, you have to walk up to him. And you'd be like, "Do you know this person?" Like, nope, we just met. Oh, nice. I'm actually wondering, can I use this teleporter? Oh, I can't. It's kind of weird to go to the plantation. Just use the scooter. You're gonna crash it. Why can't? I mean, I could like grab onto the back or something. That looks really fun. Since I'm at, what's it called, level 2, it takes like 2 hits to kill the bats. Which is really stupid. And they're just little bats. It shouldn't take that much. I'm really tempted to just try and dash through all these, but I know if I do that I'm gonna die. Good. Just get that, what's it called, back my level. There we go. Not gonna easily take out these guys. Just try and dash through them all. Yeah, here we go. Now we should go back to the teleporter. Yes. And now we'll actually see if we actually have the path to the truly true ending. Actually, I want to check something because if it said what I think it said, I'm going to be really, really... But... Okay, what I'm pretty much thinking here is that, um... It said you had to get through all this in 14 minutes, but maybe it wasn't talking about Sand Zone. I mean, maybe it wasn't talking about all that. Maybe it was talking about Sand Zone. And if it was, then that's gonna be terrible. Because I really don't feel like doing that. I'm actually gonna have to look, go look at that video later because, um... 
if that happens, I'm going to be really screwed because Sandzone was terrible for me. You I mean, if, you, if you're just now joining us and you see like, oh, he's got two endings down, I want to see the true ending, then you'd probably be here, I guess, if you want. And then, um, you'll know how bad I was at Sandzone. I just, I'm just kind of skipping through the text now. I really don't care that much about it since we... I mean, you may. I don't. Yeah, it's solid. So we didn't do it. Don't worry. That's just the way the truly true ending. I mean, the truly best ending. If I actually, why am I still here? You know, I may as well fight Curly since I'm already here. Hey, how's it going? I have like, hey, a visitor, and they just kind of they try they just try and murder you. Pretty much, you just want to try and murder the Collins first. Hey, really? She ran up to me, that's the stupid part, and let me guess, I'm all the way back at the bushlands. Yeah, I'm just gonna get back and close it off there. Yeah, I don't know how you- that, that boss battle took me like five minutes if you want to count it. So I'm pretty much screwed by that time. Uh, I'm gonna have to go through all this again. I'm feeling just- I'm- I actually kind of want to check if I can actually just run through it like I did my other playthrough. My easy playthrough, so it would have been kind of easier to dash through all the enemies. So I probably can't do it here. Seeing how much different this game is if you do that. That one's actually really close. I can just really... That boss fight is just like I'm probably gonna say that that boss fight is probably my most hated boss fight of all time. Oh yeah, look at that! Look at that! Don't care, I'm invincible. No, okay. Yep. Death, because he's gonna use the Mimi Go with the red flowers. I actually want to kind of see what King would look like if he had it. I mean, he is like the most different of all of them with his. I mean, he already has kind of red eyes. I swear that that's my favorite line of that whole game is when um Booster walks up. He's like, "Have you met this guy before?" No, we we're just now meeting. I know he's like, "Do you know this guy?" And he's like, "No, we're just now meeting." Mm hmm You can probably hear me tapping there on my keyboard. I'm just gonna peel and then save again. This could be the end because it's like one let me check. I'll tell you what time it is. It's twelve fifty one. There we go. Okay, so this is the end. See ya.